Hey everybody, welcome back. Lee, WW2DX, RomoHamRadio.com. And in this tutorial, we're going to set up N1MM with uh, CW for contesting, uh, running through the uh, RHR app. Okay, so uh, I'm going to assume that you already have the RHR desktop app and DaxCat and N1MM already installed on your machine. So what we're going to do first is we're going to fire up the uh, RHR app. And we are going to go connect to a station. Oh, let's go over here to Wyndham. Let's go ahead and connect up. Okay. And then what we're going to do is next step is to fire up Smart Cat. In this case, we're going to use Smart Cat for our virtual com com cables here so we're going to connect up with smart cat we're going to say webdx we have our two com ports here so we'll just throw these over here for a second all right we're going to fire up n1mm i just installed this here okay and what we're going to do is we're going to we have a com4 we can see com4 is uh set up with n1mm logger and again if if you don't have these com ports you can always click add You'll get this pop up here, and then you could pick what you want to create for a virtual comp port. Cat, uh, obviously for cat commands or logging software. OT RSP is for um, SO2R boxes. Uh, PTT, WinCure, and n one m spots. So I'm going to cover these uh, as well, as a matter of fact. Okay, so I'm just going to close that. So we have these two. We see N1MM is connected. We can see N1MM has 14.100 here. If we want to look at um, the configs, configure ports, um, that's actually wrong. So we're going to say um, flex 6000 series com4 and 40. You probably don't care what this is, but we'll just make it 38.4. Hit OK. Let's um, and then we let's go OK here again. Let's just see if this is tracking along here. Yeah, so you can see we're at the 14.125. You can see N1MM 14.125.5. So this is all tracking along the way we expect it to. Let's zoom back out here. Okay, so we have N1MM now connected to the remote flex, all working the way we expect. So let's go ahead and get the CW going now. So in order to do CW, we're gonna click the Add button. We wanna add a virtual wind here. And we, we are going to say save. And this is going to create a virtual wind here for us. Okay, saving. Okay, so now you can see here we have serial com5. And in back over here, we're going to say ports. We're going to say com5 CW. And then we're going to select win key here, okay, for the inside the settings. So we're going to hit OK. Com port. One thing you have to do is restart N1MM. It doesn't know that that com port exists anymore. So we're going to close N1MM. And we're going to open N1MM back up. Okay. And now you can see serial com5 process N1MM logger. So now it's grab the uh, virtual win key here. So let's kind of just move a few windows around real quick here. Just got stuff all over the place. Okay, um, so here we have N1MM up and running. And we're on a, let's go down the band here, just clear frequency. Okay, we're in CW039. And uh, let's bring the volume up a little bit here. So now if I simply go into run mode, and hit CQ. And there it is. So let's say somebody comes back to me. Uh, we, we say uh, ON4UN comes back. Oh, it would be better if I actually put it into enter send mode. So let's say ON4UN comes back. And then I just say enter. And we work them and log them. Simple as that. 
Okay, so that's setting up N1MM, CW, great for contesting uh, using the RHR desktop app uh, in this tutorial. And there's a lot more to cover, but this will just get the basics going.